Have you ever seen a doctor examining a patient while holding a flashlight to his eye and wonder to yourself what this doctor is looking at? He is not an ophthalmologist and the patient doesn't complain of any eye-related issues, so why is the doctor doing that? Before we get started, I'd like to recommend you subscribing to this channel and enable the notification bell so you won't miss any updates of our new videos about questions that just pops up to your mind and you don't know the answers to. When a doctor examines a patient's eye and using a light source like a flashlight, he can gather various information about the patient's condition and the vital functions in the body. This is not related to the eye itself. For example, in the normal cases, when a doctor shines the flashlight to the right eye, the pupil should respond to the light and start to constrict. This occurs because the eye in this situation tries to reduce the amount of light entering it. The same thing happens to the left eye even as it's not exposed to the light. Therefore, its pupil diameter should be reduced as well. When this simple reaction happens, doctors can understand that the eye's retina, which receives light, is functioning normally, and as a result, the optic nerve is also functioning normally, and therefore the vision centers in the brain are also functioning normally. If the doctor shines a flashlight on the eye and discovers that the pupil remains dilated and its diameter doesn't change, it indicates that the person has a problem in the brain or may be experiencing a stroke or at least a lack of oxygen supplied to the brain. This often happens in cases of accidents and doctors open the patient's eye and shine the flashlight on it to check the brain functions. This is not limited to emergency cases only. It's possible for you to visit a doctor for a regular checkup and the doctor may holds a flashlight and shines to your eyes. The light in this situation could assist the doc to detect any indications of swelling or inflammation around the eye. This could be a sign that the patient has allergies or kidneys issues. And if the color of the inner membrane of the eyelid is pale, it could be a sign of anemia. And if the eye protrudes from its cavity, it could be an indication of thyroid gland problems. And if there is a rupture of the blood vessels of the retina, it could be a sign of a high blood pressure. During the examination, doctors can find all these things and much more by just shining a flashlight into the patient's eye. 